honors them with a tent to live in. He honors them with a $450 increase in their rent. Before this prime minister, we didn't have masses of military members living in tent cities, Mr. Speaker. They could put a roof overhead. In fact, we didn't have 30 tent cities in Halifax. We didn't have 2 million people lined up at food banks in, in lines that are reminiscent of the Great Depression. We didn't have young people forced to wait till they're age 40 to get a home. The good news is life was not like this before this prime minister, and it won't be like this after he's gone. Yeah. Why doesn't he just say it straight out, Mr. Speaker? He's planning to make Canada great again. The reality is, Mr. Speaker, Canada is great. Canada is the best country in the world. And yes, there are challenges, and that's why we're stepping up. In assessing Justin Trudeau's leadership, Pierre Poilievre provides a critical perspective. Going beyond addressing concerns about stability to highlight adverse effects of Trudeau's policies, such as soldiers residing in tent cities and rising rental costs. Polyevre appreciates Trudeau's recognition of Canada's challenges and commitment to finding solutions. Trudeau acknowledges imperfections within the self-proclaimed best country in the world, reflecting on the pre-Trudeau era, not only as a critique of democratic practices, but as a yearning for a more prosperous and stable realm articulated through Trudeau's rhetoric. This aligns with socialist values, emphasizing norm and structure preservation. While Trudeau asserts Canada's greatness, it overlooks nuanced aspects of the current situation, raising questions about contrasting views with Poilievre and whether it signifies commitment to navigating existing conditions or reverting to the past. Poilievre enumerates issues from tent cities to food bank lines prompting an examination of individual responsibilities and the extent of government intervention, calling for a deeper understanding of issue structures and the adverse consequences of specific policies.